BuckeyeHuddle.com. We are here in Buford, Georgia, home of 2026 defensive lineman Bryce Perry Wright, one of Ohio State's top recruiting targets. Uh, just got done with your spring game against Norcross. Mm -hmm. uh, how did things go out there, and how's your spring going? Uh, the spring game went really good. I think we're doing better as a team. We're coming together. You know, it was just a spring game. We still got the summer to get to, so we're going to do good later on. This is one of our, this is a chaotic interview. We got we got all sorts of stuff going on here. Uh, so, Bryce, um, just what are you working on this spring? Where, where are you trying to put your focus into improving your game? Uh, I want to put my, more of my focus into the team. Uh, I don't want to be all about me. I want to more about the team. So <laughs> I want us to be a team so we can come to state championship. Leadership. Yes, sir. <laughs> uh, what are your, you know, what are your impressions of Ohio State so far? What, what are some things that have stood out with them? I know that's a school that you're, you're talking to quite a bit. They're recruiting you pretty hard. Mm -hmm. uh, I like Ohio State D-line coaches. Um, as a program alone, you know, you know, they're one of the few schools that have Heisman D-line coach, uh, D-line players, uh, one of the highest people to have a first-round draft pick as a D-lineman. So, you know, the coaches know what they're doing there and a great program. Yep. What are your thoughts on just uh, the spring visit? You, went, you were at the spring game. Anything uh, jump out to you about that? You know, the coaches, you know, feel like family, you know, knowing the program of Ohio State, you know, going in there, seeing all the trophies of 124, I think it is. So, you know, seeing that, you know, always make you proud. How cool is it to see Edric and what, what he's doing right now? Very cool. You know, me and Edric, that's my dog. You know, zero and three, always on the D-line. Forever remember that. Uh, it was very good, you know, seeing him, you know, he comes out here to support me. I go out there to support him, so it was really good. He's here tonight. Yes, sir. So, uh, he, was, he was in the coach's box with you guys, coaching up. Um, you know, how close are you two, and, and do, does his presence at Ohio State impact you at all? Is that is that something, would you like to play with him at the next level? Yes, sir, I would, <laughs> yes, sir, I uh, would definitely like to play with him soon. You know, if I end up going there, I'd definitely play with him soon. What has he told you so far about his experience at Ohio State? I'm sure you're able to get some advice mm -hmm. from him on everything. Uh, they're not going to just lead you the way if you're not wanting to get better. Ed, I heard Edric, all the coaches tell me that Edric stays in the building to get better. He asks every coach as he stays. He's the last person to leave, first one in. Yep. So he tells me to get better every day, and he's uh, preaching that to me. Best coaching relationship at Ohio State, is it Larry Johnson? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, Larry Johnson, uh, BT Jordan, and yep. Coach E. Yep. What, what do you think has made Coach Johnson – so successful and kind of what are some things what are you, what has drawn you to him as far as just building a good relationship there the legacy the legacy had you know for a coach to come out and recruit he doesn't re really recruit a lot of guys so if you won a few ones you know you're a dog so <laughs> um, as far as your summer where mm -hmm. are some schools you're going to try and get to uh, I'm gonna see how the school uh, school schedule goes, and then I'm gonna pick up in and you know fill in what I can do and you know yeah. situate it around. Any idea when you might try to get back to Ohio State? Would it be like maybe in a game for, game in the fall? Yeah, or? I would definitely be up to a game for sure. Um, I'm gonna uh, get that scheduled out and get to a game for sure. Yep. Uh, who else are you building a good relationship with so far? Not you know that's not just. Ohio State or uh -huh. some other schools you're building a good relationship with? Uh, that's actually a lot of schools. You know, really most of the schools that offer me, I really talk to like from the day-to-day -day basis. So, you know, I just keep in touch with them, keep it neutral. Yep. And then lastly, what's going to be important to you when you go on your visits to kind of see from different schools, make sure that, you know, that could be the right place for you? If I can get that feel like it's home already, like some schools you go to a school, you feel like it's home already to the point you'd be like, yeah, this is the place. And then, uh, you know, get, get a good relationship with the coaches. Uh, you know, when everyone goes to a school, you've got a good relationship with the coaches because you got to be with them for four years, yep. four to three years. So you might as well yep. get cool with them now yep. while you're in the recruiting process. All right, Bryce Perry Wright, one of the top, again, yes, one of the top defensive linemen in the country in 2026. Yes, Thanks, man. Appreciate your time. Good luck no the rest of the spring. Yes, sir. Yep.